guys, Rusty K here. I want to put up a little bit different of a video today. I was in a sales meeting this morning and my, my uncle sends me a text and uh, shows a picture of at a garage sale he was at that had a bunch of models and I mean a lot of models. And uh, he sends me the text and he says, hey, listen, I saw these models. He knows I do models. And says, this guy's selling these. And I said, well, how much for all of them? And he says, uh, let me talk to him. So he ends up buying, buying these for me. 80 bucks. Actually, 70 bucks. I, get, I gave him $10. So $80 for all these. There are some serious vintage kits in here. And uh, I would say 75% of these are still in the plastic. The boxes may be a little old or beat up, but I opened them up. And, and a lot of these, 75% of these are still in the plastic. A couple still... Uh, when I say in the plastic, the box open, but the, in in the plastic, the kit intact in the in the, in the plastic. A couple of them still have uh, the uh, the wrapping around it. Now I'm going to apologize up front for the for the camera work I'm about to to give you because I don't have these all set up, but I just wanted to go through. There must be, I don't know. I think we counted 70 or 80 kits. So if you break it down, a buck, maybe two bucks most uh, per kit. So I'm going to break these down for you. I'm not going to go through opening them all up and showing you, but there is some serious stuff I never even heard of or would have thought to do, but let me, uh, let me pick up the camera here and sort of show you what I'm, what I'm talking about. All right, so he comes back with this box full of these kits. Um, like I said, I'm not going to do it justice here. I'm going to go through some of these and show you what... Uh, what some of these are. Um, so like I said, I'm going to apologize for the camera angle, but I'll sort of bring some of these up here and show you uh, some of the ones I have over here on the bench. Um, you know, I mean, this, this hall is just, uh, it's just massive. Um, some of these are ones I was just sort of looking at at first. And like I said, I'll just sort of go through this. Like I said, sorry for the camera angle. Some of the ones I thought were kind of really cool. Things like this. Those are really cool. Uh, some of the stuff that still is a plastic, uh, as far as being even wrapped. Uh, like I said, sorry, sorry for the camera, you guys. Uh, you know, some of these are 20 bucks. It's still sealed in the plastic. 20 bucks a kit. You know, so I got all of these for 80 bucks, and there's some really cool stuff here. This here, apparently this guy's uh, bought this house, and this stuff was just in the house. This is, these are paper airplanes, guys. You build paper airplanes. Don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but I thought it was kinda cool. Um, there's even some, uh, I mean, there's just, you know, some awesome kits in here. Some really old vintage cars. Like I said, some of these boxes are beat up. But some of them may need to, you know, I have to go through and do some research on these things. But these are some old, old, old kits. There's even a die cast in here. You know? Um, I mean, I'm going to sit here and go through these, but, I mean, all of this for 80 bucks. Some of them are in better condition than others, but um, some have been, I, I would say probably uh, three or four, it looks like they were started. We'll have to do some restoration work. I mean, this obviously will keep me going for years to come, but, uh, you know, just, I'm still going, guys, I mean, I've just, so far I've shown you those, those are still over there, I won't make this too long, just wanted to give you guys an idea. He, the, the, whoever had these was apparently into Woody's because there's several 
Woody's here. The other two were Woody's. That one last one wasn't. The beetle. This one's still in the plastic. Like I said, I would say 75% of these are still in the plastic. Um, this is, I think this is a die cast car actually. But you know, this here was really interesting. Old box, I don't know much about this, but this is all still in the plastic. You know, I mean, I don't understand. I don't understand it. There's actually a uh, a plane in here. I know you're probably getting bored of looking at these kits. You know, who knows? If somebody's even interested in these kits, some of these kits, you know, let me know. I may be able to help you out with a trade or something. This one's still in the plastic. I mean, this is just ancient stuff here. I mean, I'm obviously not going to get to... This is still sealed factory plastic. I'm trying to find, just pull out a couple other really cool things over here. See if I can... I mean, there's just a ton of stuff over here. This one here is still in the box, is a little beat up, but another Woody. And this one here, the kit's still, everything's here, not put together, not in the plastic, but still in the sprue trees. Um, <laughs> I don't know what these things are worth, but if you average, you know, what we spend nowadays for kits, uh, you know, 20 bucks a kit, 15 bucks a kit, there's over, uh, like I said, there's probably 70 kits here. I know you're probably getting bored of looking at this, but I was just amazed. You know, the picture that he took and sent me did not do it justice of what he brought to me and dropped off. Um, there's actually even a classic little Streetcar, more woodies. Might do some kit bash on some woodies. Just a few more here. I mean, there's more than a few down here, but you know. Hope everybody's new year is uh, is going well. Still in the plastic. Old boxes. This one's still in the plastic inside. Sealed. This one's sealed factory box, NASCAR. of what he found. Like I said, the whole lot, even this crate down here, I'll show you the crate, you probably already saw it. Um, even this crate down here. So yeah, all that. Still a few more over here. But all of that 80 bucks. You know, I've already looked at a couple to see how much they were worth, and there's there's some uh, there's some cool kits there. So, anyways, just wanted to uh, 
throw this up there. I thought it was kind of cool. Uh, of what my uncle came back with, you know. Um, have no idea what I'm going to do with them all, but, you know, I thought it was kind of cool for him to do that. Give me a call. Let me know he found them. Uh, he knows I do these. So, Uncle Scott, you the man, brother. Any questions on any of these, let me know. If you have any information, good information on some of these that, that I don't know about, let me know. Thanks, guys.